Do it, hop into AMG. Start up first time because we started it yesterday. Watch how this works. Sedilio Martilio, I'm coming to y'all with another banger video. I lost my hair ties, so my hair is down, but here we are at AutoZone, and we got the AMG outside, then we got it running. Trust me, ain't nothing wrong with my baby, of course, but we are here at AutoZone. The thing is, we gotta figure out, is the battery good? Does it need to be recharged, or do we need a new battery? Let's go and hopefully find someone, and then we get to talk to them and all this stuff. You know, this is a supercar type beat type level type thing have like if the car sits the battery might go down whatever maybe it just needs to be driven more and i'm just tweaking out who knows but we gonna find out said uh we don't have the battery measuring machine at that auto zone so we can oh 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 o'reilly's auto part race car is all the way at the bottom of like here we go it would just sit for a couple days, have trouble starting up. I don't know if the battery will just need to be like recharged or a new one, deceased. So that vent was for it to go in, sucking air for the turbos. But now you don't need that. Well, it still needs it because it still forces air onto the turbos. Yeah, MFR taught me this. Shout out to MFR engineer. Air goes and forces it in. That's what this flap is for. Oh, yeah. So when there's no air, it closes, but when there's air, goes in onto the turbos but what, out the back of that which yeah is where, so right. for that one it's reading a bad battery bad battery yeah so it would need a new battery yeah okay cool that's what i suspected y'all my that's just probably age hey yeah like i wonder how old that battery is yeah facts yeah it's probably just age I didn't notice anything else just uh -huh. start or what? so like every time i would try to start it all the lights would turn on then it would just like cut out and die so, but when I got gave it a little gas to start it, of course it like came on. But usually, that was yesterday. Then I started it today with no problem. So, oh, okay. yeah. Probably because you got a little bit of charge after running it. Yep. Yeah, uh, your best best part is replacing it. Okay, yeah. new battery. Yep. Thank you, bro. So. AMG needs a new battery. Say, Scrub, remind me. If you get into a special event, don't make this mistake I made. You go to a special event, aka the AMG was a SEMA. They offer you a free battery. Say yes. Please say yes. Did they offer you a free battery? You said no. Yeah, they offered me a free battery at SEMA. I said no. You should have just had it anyway. Like, I would have just sold it on eBay. <laughs> Turn used battery to AutoZone Clearly. for proper recycling. They wouldn't have put that on there in Germany, let's just say. That would have said, return used battery to AutoZone for a new free battery. I would have did it. I don't know where it's going. We are going to get a new battery for the AMG, and that is literally probably the only problem it has. So yeah, after all these years, all this time, the bad problem with the AMG is the freaking battery. Isn't that like hilarious? You actually have the vents where the yeah. heat can come out. That's the only way that got cooling. The vent had a lot of heat in the cabin. Like right. a lot of heat will build up in the cabin. Inside. Because of the turbos right here sitting on top and it's so close to the cabin right there. Heat in the cabin was unbearable. When we cut that, easier way for the turbos to get cooling, the heat comes out. So it's unbearable in the cabin of the car, so yeah. No Mercedes, if you're watching, is if your engine ends here, and your radiator ends here. Why have you got so much extra car? It's just long. The Germans know what they're talking about. That, that's how Germans sound. They sound very mean. You, go, you need to go to Germany, bro. Is that how they sound? No. <laughs> Their language is mean. The way you say it, you know, hospital in German is Krakenhaus. Krakenwagen. Let's go to the Krakenwagen. We brought the energy to the Krakenwagen. Krakenwagen is ambulance. Oh. Krakenhaus is... Cracking house. And you know Andy been to Germany before? Andy doesn't shop at all oh, big. Oh. Sat to dye his. I just saw my eye, eyes out the other day. Yeah. We're back, we're almost ready to go. Yeah. But... Make sure you go watch this video and you'll see why he had to do that, all that stuff. But no, Andy doesn't shop at all oh, big. If you're looking at his eye. Close the hood, now we go and see how much a battery is. Dude, this is the struggle of having an AMG where, cause it's just AMG, so it never comes up on here. Like the AMG never pops up anywhere when you search for it. Figure out the battery issue. So we are going to get a new battery. They don't have one here, so we have to find a battery somewhere else. But I'm kind of hungry, so let's get some food. Same squad, are y'all hungry? Let me know if y'all hungry. But for this car to only literally have a battery issue for all it's been through, kind of absurd. Tomorrow. Can y'all believe this? Three days in a row. Smooth touch. And this is two days in a row.
Kind of dilly on my chili, y'all. So right now, first we are heading up to a gas station. We are taking the AMG up to West Coast Exotics. It's sad to say, the AMG has been a complete legend on the channel. It has made history on the channel. It has built a legacy. It has been a building block towards the empire. But it's had its time. You guys don't watch it, so now it's time to go. But three days in a row, we've been to AMG. Isn't that crazy? But we're going to West Coast Exotics. See if they'll buy it. And maybe we might have to take the wrap off. Who? Who freaking knows? That's what I'm thinking, but I don't know. We'll figure that out. And in the process of taking it up there, going up there, we might find our next car to the channel up there as well. So, stay tuned. Go ahead, make a dinner. Reheat your leftovers. Go make some pizza rolls in the microwave. If you haven't already, go make some Kool-Aid and enjoy this bank video. Just went to the gas station. Look what we got. Bam. Bam. Road trip snack. Deuce today. Bam. Crippling gum addiction. It happens. Now, we have an hour drive, Saint Squad. Yes, hour drive because West Coast Exotics is an hour from here. AMG with terrible speakers. Don't know how I signed up for this. I did. It happened. And now it's happening. We'll be all right. At least you guys don't have to suffer through the hour drive with terrible speakers. So enjoy this. What's your good speakers you're listening to at home? We have made it to West Coast Exotics. This is what some of y'all want to see. This is what y'all y'all want to be like. Take the AMG and get this. But it's a Challenger. I've been a Charger, babe. I used to actually really want a Challenger Scat Pack. Like before I actually got one, I wanted a Challenger. And this color isn't that bad. I'm saying if we did get the Scat Pack, it would probably have to be a Charger. Do you guys think? Comment down below and let me know. Got a big red eye too. Challenger or Charger? Comment down below and let me know. But then it would be new because I never did a challenger on the channel I've always been a charger so I mean like and there's this 458 so you guys do know me and turbos for our company we're getting a 458 for it and miraculously they have a 458 here at West Coast Design, so we'll have to get back to that but first let's check on the AMG and see what we could do about that I just talked to Hunter they said that the AMG is to modify for them to buy it or consign it so that is out the window and most likely wouldn't even be able to trade it in for anything but what do you guys think the smarter option would be to trade in or sell it i think i still will want to just sell it get rid of it then like find something because a lot of you guys are on board with a scat pack but then some of you guys are like okay and all this stuff so it, it's something that we would see would you guys want it to be a challenger or a charger i feel like i would trade it in but i have no idea came out here got shut down denied but it's cool We'll be all right, Saint Squad. Right. AMG 2 1 of 1. You know what I'm saying? It'd be like that. The stuff you gotta go with when you want the ones, of course. Everything 1 of 1. <laughs> It'd just be like that. Now, 458. 458 shall be coming to the channel pretty soon with an insane bill, all this stuff, right? But I never actually like seen one. This one's like all black, black inside, yellow stitching like this. I mean, natural Ferrari look huge on the inside for no reason at all, but um. Yeah, even ceramic brake. They say the best sound of V8. Naturally aspirated V8, which I kind of agree because when I heard one for the first time actually like broke my neck, right? I said, stare at her. I think that might be the best naturally sound of V8. You just kind of hear one straight piped. When they're not straight piped, they're extremely quiet. But straight piped, best sound of V8. So we would literally do Liberty Walk kit, big wing. I asked some MFR stuff in there. Yeah, we we gonna do the whole shebang. But the only thing is, we gotta figure out which one we're getting. So we're leaving that all up, the turbo and all that stuff. But I'll probably tell turbo, like, look at this one. We can probably look at this one, all that stuff. Because it is decently priced because the prices on them did go up. I mean, before COVID, dude, 458s were getting into like 120. They went up like 100K. Hopefully they could go down a little bit again, but I don't know, we'll see. Major question is, do we sell the AMG or do we trade it in for something else? What do you guys think would be the easier option? Also, I'm thinking about taking off the top part of the wrap and probably just keeping it straight black how it was. Maybe it would that would be even easier to sell it that way. Those two questions, comment down below and let me know, Saint Squad. I'm kind of confused, but I still do want some answers. I still do want to know some. Comment down below, let me know. If you still want to buy it, you can still buy it. My email's in the description or DM me on Instagram as well. I'm down to negotiate a price and all that stuff. And you can't have this thing of a beast. And don't worry, 
the battery will be in where you buy it. We have made it back and I feel like we haven't been in the Huracan. It's been two videos and three days in a row. We have been in the AMG, but here it is. Next video, we will be in the Huracan because my mom finally comes into town and we have to pick my mom up from the airport. Then we have a couple stuff. I gotta show her around, of course, this weekend. This will be her first time seeing the Huracan, seeing the new graph and everything. How the OG days are. We'll get her opinion on the rap. We'll take her on a ride in the Huracan with the new tune and flames and all that stuff because she's only been in this stock. Stay tuned for all of that. Next video, we pick up my mom from the airport in the Huracan. Her first time literally seeing this. Her first time being in California since when I literally first started YouTube. You can also find those videos way, way, way back on my channel as well. It was literally when I first started. They only had like 600 subscribers. This car will be in Tuner Evo this weekend as well. So stay tuned for that. If you're going to Tuner Evo, you'll be able to see the AMG in person. It will be with Newport Drip. So I got to get the rims cleaned up. I got, I got to get this car cleaned up. They posted the Huracan the other day, which I appreciate that. I just want to say thank you, Saint Swamp, for literally everything. Thank you guys for believing in me. And I've seen a couple comments talking about, I'm happy for you that you learned to take your L, not a loss, but a lesson and all this stuff with the whole thing with the AMG. So I'm really grateful for you guys because anyone else would probably get murdered or destroyed, which some people were destroying me in the comments on that one video, which is why I deleted it. It was too much. Like I said, I won't speak on the negativity. Refunds are going now. I'm getting them done daily. Thank you guys for being on this journey with me. Understand that I have learned my lesson and it's not a loss, but it's a lesson. And next time we ever do a giveaway or something, we'll understand. Enough of that stuff. We don't need any negativity. Thanks, so I'm just thanking you guys for literally everything. You guys are being, and you guys being the best. AMG Tuner Evo this weekend, so we will have to get a car wash. My mom comes this weekend, so she'll be able to see this thing in person for the first time. Sounds like we're going to have a great weekend. So, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, go down, smash the like button. The subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss the next video because the next video we pick my mom up from the airport in a Lamborghini and that's literally a dream thing to do like picking your mom up from the airport in a Lamborghini in California is next level dream level so I'm happy about that and I will catch you guys in the next video with my mom arriving in California peace